You're in my chair. Just updating the encryption on your bat tech. But if you want me to stop... Oh, no, the seat is all yours. This is the thing you were talking about? One of Riddler's puzzles. Some kind of test. Show me. Huh. Any idea what he's planning? Not yet. That's why I need your help. If his history is anything to go by, he left us a clue. A psychological profile of Riddler. Uh, knowing how his mind works, this should come in handy. No sign of explosives or poison. Already scanned for that in the cave. sound it's giving off. A signal, maybe? <laughs> I couldn't decipher it. I was hoping you could help with that. I'll see what I can do. Shouldn't take long. What in the... It's not one of mine. Think fast. Hi, Dad. <laughs> Tiffany? Hey, Bruce. Tip my God, Tiffany. It's been a while. Sneaking out of orientation your first day? I just wanted to say hi to my new boss. I got you a present. A micro drone prototype I developed in my spare time. High-end AV, stealth black shell, programmable for autonomous observation. Small, quiet, and super smart. Just like its designer. Not bad, huh? You always had a thing for toys. So hard to know what to get a man who has everything. I love it. Thanks, Tiffany. Well, I guess it's not bad. Not bad. See what I had to deal with growing up? Huh. There's something different about you. Uh, there is? And I don't just mean what happened to your ear. I can't quite put my finger on it. But you look... You look... You look... Well, please, just don't say old. Well, now that you mention it. Hey, play nice. Bruce has had a rough year. Interesting. Don't. Too late. Already touching. Just be careful. What a strange thing. The circuitry design. It's elaborate and unorthodox. Almost intentionally so. Like, whoever put it together was kind of showing off. Huh. Micro pulse waves? It's just weird. Seriously, what is this thing? I've never seen anything like it. It's like whoever made it. It's pretty cool, huh? I don't know if cool would be the word I would use. I can hear it hum. What does it do? That's what we're trying to work out. You guys are lucky I'm here to help. Uh help with figure this freakish thing out uh, tiffany did graduate first in her class at cornell in molecular engineering let me take a crack at it i can help you get to the bottom of this figure out what it does all right if you think you can help then be my guest oh i know i can help i just gotta let him know that i won't be finishing up orientation uh, no problem oh i was planning on swinging by the manor after work to see alfred i heard he wasn't doing so well that he's having some issues with his health? I think that's a great idea. He could use some company. No offense, guys, but Alfred is way more entertaining than you two. Catch you guys later. Welcome aboard, Tiffany. Thanks boss all right then time to crack this puzzle I never told her you know told her what I really do at Wayne Enterprises what uh, we do if you're willing to pull her into this Riddler project 
Why not consider bringing her into the fold? Into the mission? We're going to need help. If we're going to be dealing with the likes of Riddler. And we can trust her. Well, if she's anything like you... She's better than me. Okay. Then... Let's give her a shot. Great. I'll start thinking about how we can broach the subject with her. In the meantime, Riddler's puzzle will be a fine start. Well, shall we go down to the lab? Actually, the equipment we need is down in my office. We'll get this taken care of in no time. Mr. Wayne. Uh, yes? I'm Special Agent Avesta. This is my partner, Special Agent Blake. Uh, well, I guess I'll see you in a bit. I'll be down in my office. Whenever you, uh, get down here. See you later, Lucius. Good chat. Oh, yeah. One of the best. Sorry for the unannounced visit. We're with the agency's behavioral analysis unit. We just came by to ask a few questions? I sure hope I'm not in any trouble. Oh, everyone's in some amount of trouble. <laughs> it's my job to find out just how much. This office, it really represents you. Well, I like to think so. Is this you? Yeah. How old? I don't know, seven, eight, maybe? <laughs> so happy. I'm sorry that didn't last. After everything you've been through, I don't know how you still do it. Do what, exactly? It wasn't long ago when you were the most hated man in Gotham, yet you still give so much back to the city. Why do you continue to help Gotham? Most people wouldn't be so charitable after that. How's it going down there? I, uh, left that file on your desk. Think you could bring it down? I'll be down in just a second. Sorry about that. What were you saying? I was saying you're a bit of a mystery. What, uh, what is it you want? The agency recently brought me in to draft a psychological portrait of the Riddler. We've been tracking him for months, but haven't been able to find him. A lot of things happened to you last year, and not all of them were good. You put yourself at risk when you helped bring in your friend Harvey Dent. He was a violent psychotic at the time, almost destroyed the city. Come to think of it, You've been associated with quite a few psychopaths over the years. I wouldn't go that far. I would. The criminally insane, they seem drawn to you. Either that, or you're often in the wrong place at the wrong time. Yes, having money and fame makes you an easy target. I've had my fair share of crazies knocking on my door. Like this guy. I think you'd know him as John Doe. We understand that it was during your stay in Arkham where you and John met and became friends. From the sound of it, you two were close. Yeah, we were friendly. He showed me around Arkham. Is that right? According to hospital records, you and John were involved in a riot. They captured the whole incident on video. John cut another inmate, a man named Victor Zaz. Then you jumped into the fray. Several people were hurt. I was... I was trying to break up a fight. I don't blame you. You must have been scared. John was discharged from Arkham months ago. No one has seen or heard from him since. I was thinking maybe you have. <laughs> Why would you think that? He listed you as his emergency contact. Uh, sounds like you two were pretty close to me. Okay, now I'm a little creeped out. I knew him for, what, a day? Maybe you made an impression on him. Well, I haven't seen or heard from him, so... Did he do something wrong? He's a person of interest. You see, 
We've got a wall in the office with a bunch of photos pinned to it. Two-Face, Penguin, Lady Arkham, you know, Gotham's most notorious. They've got all these little strings connecting them to one another, like a web. And you, my friend, are at the center. You keep pretty strange company for someone who wants everyone to think they're such a stand-up guy. You know more than you're letting on, Mr. Wayne. Maybe you're afraid. Maybe you don't trust us. Or maybe you're a criminal, like your father. Maybe you're not the hero people think you are. Get the hell out of my... That's an evacuation warning. It's time for you to leave. We'll pick this up another time. Yourself out. What are you talking? What did you figure out? I've I've solved the Riddler's puzzle, Bruce. Uh, Riddler really pulled a good one over on us. I might still be able to disable it, but Lucius, please tell me what's wrong. Tell Tiffany that I love her. That I'm sorry I wasn't around more. Lucius, we really made a difference, didn't we, Batman? Lucius! 